Welcome back guys, Discount Tools here again. Just want to do a update video on this uh, Milwaukee 56 piece uh, shockwave case. Um, if you saw my last video, this, this is a really cool idea, except Milwaukee, for some reason, cannot figure out that you need an easier way to get this out. This is, if you can see, in here there's no grooves to let it slide out and there should be I understand that you want these little holders and even this to not move around or anything but this is really crazy I don't know if any of you guys have seen anything maybe easier or an easier way to take these out but I I've been trying for a little while uh, trying to collect my thoughts on it, and you just can't get it out. So, that's number one. Two, these are de definitely double bits. Um, this is actually a really cool little bit. Um, it's Torx on both sides, and I'm probably using that a lot. And then you have a uh, Phillips and a flathead double bit, which is pretty cool um, that you get with these guys. And if you can see, there's a little, might have wiped it off, but on both of these and some of the uh, other bits, they have a little oil on it for, uh, I'm guessing for, uh, help with corrosion and the life of the, uh, of the, uh, tool of the bet to help them out there. Oops, sorry, guys, I'm just trying to. Or I organize this. But the main part is, I got this back together. This is the removable case. And as you can see, I just want to show you, do a little review on this. It did come with a couple of bit, a lot of bits in here. A lot of different types of bits. So you got fill, you know, that's Torx. Some Torx in here, it's different size Torx. You got a flathead in here. Oh, sorry guys, I'm going looking through the camera. You have flat heads. There's probably some Phillips in here if you look around. But this is the cool part. You can, you know, like I said, I'm going to use this. Move that to the one side, you know, to one side. And then you can put some double bits in here. Whatever you want to use. With, or not use, but instead of taking this huge case with you, you can take this case, put whatever bits you're going to use. The double bit, maybe. Oh, look, I need a Phillips right in there, you know? That's pretty cool. Close it up. And you can just throw this in your pocket. Uh, your little uh, tool bag, uh, contractor bag that you get from the uh, tool companies, even the uh, tough case, you know, tough, the tough case, pl uh, hard plastic. Um, or anything else, you know, just throw it in, it's small enough, um, which is pretty cool. So, that's my review on this, and my final thoughts on this. I'm not even going to put it back in, I'm just going to leave it in like that for now. Just close it up like that. And I cl this case is really solid, though. This is probably the be one of the better cases, and you also have a place to put a belt hook on so you can just attach this to your uh, belt instead of just moving it around that way if you're going on the ladder or anything like that it doesn't fall but other than that hey right, guys that'll be it for me tonight hopefully so besides me having that case rip open and all the bits fly out if you guys want to see that again I'll leave a link up here for that last video but until then guys have a good night happy new years i'll see you uh probably in a couple of days i'm probably gonna I'll post another video tomorrow and new year's day but uh until then keep on trucking guys if you like the video please like subscribe hit that bell notification oh yeah please subscribe and um Leave a comment down below. Let me know how I'm doing. Again, subscribe.
let's grow these numbers. We're getting there. And uh, have a happy new year, guys. Keep on trucking.